congratulations on the film. Thank, Thank you. you. I watched it last night. I was like on the edge of my couch. My dog was in suspense as well. <laughs> so what was your first impression of Ethan? Oh my gosh, my first impression of yeah. uh -oh. Ethan, I was uh -oh. like, oh, he's fun. Oh, good, it wasn't, yeah. he has bad breath or something. No, like that. no, yeah, no, yeah, no. Yeah. I was like, oh my gosh, he's so friendly and his eyes are so bright. I was like, okay, okay. I mean, it's like super disarming. He's like so nice, nice. so friendly, so uh, ready to play. My second impression was then when we got to work, I was like, oh, this man is standing on business. Ooh, he likes first to impression, play. First impression, second impression. Yeah, the okay. first was the guy, the second one was the, the actor, the icon. The you know. actor and the icon. Ethan, speaking of icons, what was it like to have Julia Roberts play your on-screen wife? Cool. Cool. Yeah, you know, we all, our, our ego can get flattered in mysterious ways, but I was like, yeah, I like this. I'll be, I'll be Julia Roberts' yeah. husband. Yeah, I can picture that. Yeah. You know, I, I don't know. I, I, like everybody else, I've spent years being entertained by her. You know, and she's uh, an obvious powerhouse. And I really liked, I like it when actors produce work they want to make. We all find that inspiring when people kind of take the reins of their own life. And I also like that she wielded that power gently. Mm -hmm. mm. Um, she never wasn't a part of the company. Yeah. Mm. Um, and, uh, and that, uh, I like that. Yeah. Speaking of wives, your IRL, your wife in real life, what was her reaction to your flirtation with Rihanna? Oh, my wife knows me, <laughs> okay? My wife knows me really well, and she laughed her ass off. Of course. What was you know, the pickup line? Like, what do you say to Rihanna? You gotta take your shot, right? <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'm a, I'm a human being. I'm I not dead. I would have done the same thing. You know, you find yourself seated next to Rihanna. You're gonna, you're gonna. What are you gonna do? Who uh, wouldn't take a shot? You're sitting on, next you to Rihanna. Chat it. Look, I, I, I'll be. I hope she doesn't. She told me that she really liked Boyhood. I was in. I, you know, Mister. So in. she opened up the door. So yeah. then I was like, Yeah. <laughs> I did too. You know. She <laughs> uh, opened so, up the door. You know. I, but she was very polite, and I, you know, I, I'm, I'm a grown man, and I'm uh, like alive. I have a heart that pumps blood, and uh, you know. <laughs> well, more uh, props to you. Yeah, my wife knows I'm a shameless flirt. She's not scared of it. She Actually, knows. You made the I'm, family proud. She knows I love her. Yeah, yeah, you took your chance with Rihanna. Who wouldn't? Now, the two of you on camera together, your chemistry was incredible. There was a certain fireplace scene, and I don't want to give it away, but what was it like? creating and building the chemistry uh, together to, to create the magic that was? That was a tough day. It was super tough. It was a long day, and we were at the end of the day, and there was a rain machine, so it was like we were outside in the cold and the rain, and it was a super-duper emotional moment. But for me, I felt grateful to be doing it with Ethan because he's really good about making like every take fresh and making it safe. Cause that was, that ended up being like a really tough day for me. And I felt very uh, looked after and cared for by him. Um, and when you feel safe with someone, you can like go there in the work. So I don't know, like people keep asking like, how did you build the chemistry? I think chemistry is something that occurs naturally. Mm. Either you have to fake it or it just exists. And I felt a kinship with all the people in this movie um, from the get. As we had a benefit, which is that our characters didn't need to, they didn't know each other well. Mm. So, and we're just really meeting. So we get to use that. And I think that chemistry, it's a mysterious thing, but if you want it, mm. it comes. That's there are true. some actors that are not very generous and it's very difficult to engage in chemistry and it can be prevented. Um, but in general, it's not so magic that, you know, when you watch certain people's careers, they often have chemistry with a lot of people. Yeah. Interesting. Mm. Yeah. Oh, they care about their scene partner. Yeah. And if you care about your scene partner and you actually want your scene partner to thrive and you know that that's gonna be good for you, yeah. you know, if she's good in the scene, 
I'm going to be good in the scene. Mm -hmm. And if I'm good in the scene, she's going to be good in the scene. And it's, there's, it's not a competition. Yeah. We want the scene to be great. We want to be in service of the scene. And then guess what? Oh, there's chemistry. Yeah. yeah. You, you, you know? It's like, that it's, it's, it's both magic and not magic at all. It came That's across. Great. It came across well. Now, my very last question for you. Oh, no. It, oh, no! Our time is up! <laughs> it is, the apocalypse is coming. It's oh, coming. No. We know it's coming. Right. Uh, Aside from your family and pets, what would you take with you? Inanimate or alive? You choose. <laughs> Food? Good answer. <laughs> Julia said shoes. Oh, wow. Oh, shoes. <laughs> She's got to walk tall in the food. Like, apocalyptic yeah. world. I think food, maybe. I am embarrassed to admit that I have a 1954 Martin guitar oh that I just love so much. And I, um, it's irreplaceable. Can you play? Not well. So it's like just to hang in no, the I show. Play it. Play. I play it. I play it. I'm not Jimi Hendrix, <laughs> you know, but I, I, it brings me a lot of joy, right? Like that's my like safe spot. Go to song. Go to. It just changes all the time. We I was, actually have that guitar here for you. Oh no, yeah. <laughs> I was trying to teach my daughter um, uh, "Busted Flat" in Baton Rouge. Me and Bobby McGee last mm. night. That's been a, a go-to. I thought my my youngest has got a little Janis Joplin in her, so oh, I thought wow. I could. I could access it, mm -hmm. you, you know, um, but no. If I, I'm embarrassed. I would. That would be the first thing I'd grab. Okay. Well, if there's a part two, then we will expect a little yeah. serenade from you. Okay. Yeah. Thank y'all so much. I Thank appreciate you. you.